I extend my deepest apologies to the people of Jonia for the hurt and confusion caused by my current circumstances. God's blessings over Jonia always. Jesse Mignola Blas. Mayor's Council of Guam Executive Director Angel Sablon reading from locked up Jotnia Mayor Jesse Blas's resignation letter this morning. As of today, there is no longer a mayor for Jonia. Blas's resignation letter penned yesterday, dated today, the same day he changed his not guilty plea. Blas now pleading guilty. It is with a heavy heart that I step down from my position as the mayor of the village of Jotnia, effective January 30th, Blas wrote. He's been behind bars since September of last year after he was indicted on federal charges related to accepting bribes to smuggle in drugs through cluster mailboxes in his village. But what about the Municipal Planning Council, the jailed former mayor appointed from prison? Sablan says if an attorney general's opinion allows it, that MPC will be sworn in. I'm hoping that the AG will come up with an opinion way before 60 days. Local election law calls for a special election to be held on the closest Saturday to 60 days after a vacancy is declared. The Guam Election Commission head Maria Pangalina telling KUAM the GEC board will meet Thursday next week to call for that special election. But how long will the winner of the special election be the mayor of Jotnia? The successful candidate will hold the office up until the um, uh, January 2021. Uh, the primary election, the general election, whoever is successful in the 2020 general election will assume office when the uh, in January. But what about the MPC Blas appointed? Now that the former mayor has pled guilty, is the MPC he appointed tainted? It's up to the, to the mayor-elect whether he retains them, or he appoints new members. Sablan said former Mayor Blas has already received his last government of Guam paycheck. Blas's former administrative assistant will run the Jotney Mayor's office, while Sablan will continue to handle the finances until the special election winner is named. For Guam's News Network, Chris Barnett reports.